Hey there, welcome to the teacher time machine. I just want to give you a quick spin around the place and show you what the teacher time can, machine can do for you. All right, so here we are. And first of all, the most important thing that we want you to know about teacher time machine is that it's really built with best instructional practice in mind. We have years and years of experience in education, so we have been doing what you have been doing, and we have built in assessment, inclusion, all of those things. I'll show you in a minute. But these are some of the things that you can do with it. You can create practically any kind of custom digital resource that you want, scripts, game, you know, activities, uh, Theater, readers, theater scripts, uh, stories, hands-on. You know, if you need little readers that you know use certain phrases, so I, like phonemic awareness, blends built in. You name it, you can do it. All right, lesson plans, assessments, and again, if we go back to the lesson plans, those lesson plans are going to have professional best practice built in because. We've done that. We've thought about assessment. We've thought about inclusion. You'll see that in a moment. And story prompt generator. This one is really fun. You can take your kids through, get their prompts for a character. It will generate the character before their eyes. And then it will take a few details and ask you to, to put them in and then generate a writing prompt for them. Lots of fun. All right, resource library is where we can share. So anything that you generate is kept for you. It's tagged for you. So you can sort it, you can find it later and put into a resource library. You also have the option of sharing it to a shared library. So you don't have to, but you can publish it and then people can share and we'll have that on the pro plan. So, and then community, this we have people coming together, sharing their thoughts and ideas about their best practices and what's working for them and you know just exploring ideas together and this will also be a, an area that we'll jump into often and help out with questions if we can so let's get started the first place you want to go is to the creation zone so here are the four different things that we mentioned that you can do with the teacher time machine let's get started with a lesson plan i want to walk you through that You should never lose your work. You should be able to find it again and again and again. So you go to my resources and here is your, here I have this. And if I want to publish to the main library, I just publish. And now I can come into here, into the library zone and we have 
our library filled with the creations of other people too. So here's all kinds of, lot of resources in here that we can share together. Notice that if it's a story time one, the different icons tell you what kind of resource it is. You also can sort it by any kind of inclusive support, any topic. If you had a topic, if you find all the ones that are on compound words, for example, there you go, and so on. So we've got it so that you can easily find your resources or the resources of others.